state your address? <laughs> There's a white door. How does light blue look like? Sam went on a white door. Are we live? Yeah, Are we we're live. live. Right, well, welcome, folks. Is that so what we needed? Do we need to clap? Podcast. Yeah, I think uh, we need to... This is the sack podcast number four. <clears throat> number four. Number we four. made it. We made it. I don't think I was surprised we made it past podcast three. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, me too. Because the wives haven't heard it yet. <laughs> Wait, what was that? I couldn't hear you. Oh, was that too far? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you can shove your face right in there. Oh my god! All right, uh, SAG podcast number four. We're we talking about boys. We got some Super Bowl talk, even though this is going to drop after the Super Bowl. So we'll have to see if our predictions are right. Well, hopefully. Yeah. I think maybe Matt. I think Mahomes breaks his leg in the uh, I'd say second quarter, like two minutes left in the half. Ooh, who's his backup? Has he even gotten hurt this year? I feel like we got you a hundred dollars. I'll give you a hundred. You give me two (laughs) dollars. I give you two. You give me a hundred if that yeah, happens. Fifty to one. So, so Justin knows this. When I had my my sports podcast, we had a Deadpool, no. and uh, the Deadpool had to do with people just getting injured and being out for the season. And it was for football, right? I think it was. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So we had a Deadpool going between the guys that were regularly on the podcast, and nobody ended up winning. Um, you know, I I tried Damn, to. That take was my question. Betty well, you White. Guys- but uh, you know, I had her too late. <laughs> but it's named a Deadpool because originally it's about drafting a team of who's like celebrities that are gonna die. Yeah, you've heard this, right? <laughs> no, no, I don't have no idea what you're talking about. You've never heard of a Deadpool? No, no what? Okay, what? We do okay, whoa, 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 We are instituting one right now on SAC podcast number four. Okay. okay, so what a Deadpool is everybody gets a horse, and the first person to die uh, wins the pot. What do you so mean let's all throw in twenty bucks. So that'd be a hundred dollars. Yeah, and we all take. Typically, you do like two or three horses. Mm-hmm. Um, what but, if we assist in this death? Do we still get the pot? <laughs> yeah, in jail. Just, I don't want any confusion. You're the cop. I'm on the other side, and you guys are like, "No, hey, you got you assisted in this. You don't yeah. get no. the." Yeah, five hundred no. bucks. Yeah, no. sorry, you can't. No. Can't assist. There's no assist. Can't assist. Oh, no assisting. No assisting. No. That's lame. No, no. Uh, the wife is heavily into this Murdoch, Murdo, Murdo, the Southern Cal- or the uh, South Carolina murder of the Netflix, right? No, no, it's live right now. Oh. What this guy? There's a murder happening right now. Yeah. Well, <laughs> there was a uh, uh, Alec. Alec. He calls himself Alec. His yeah. name's Alex, <clears throat> and he's a very prominent, very wealthy family in South Carolina, and they're all a very long line history of, um, of lawyers. And he apparently killed his son and his wife. So it's cra- it's crazy. It's crazy. What's going on right now. right now? Yeah, they actually just had a bomb threat at their at their uh, at the courthouse. I think it was yesterday. It was the same day as <clears throat> the bomb threat. Did you guys hear the bomb threat? At the local San elementary San school? I heard about that. In San Marcos? No. Well, I got the ring notification yeah, that's what I saying did. that they yeah. the had fuck? to send all the kids somewhere else. Yeah. So I would pick Alec Murdoch <laughs> to die first. <laughs> so I think if we all throw in 20 bucks, we all take a horse. And then whoever, whoever's, you know, I mean, like Betty White, she was a pretty good horse to have until she passed away. No. Um, but whatever you guys think. Maybe uh, think about it. Is it just? Do we just get to pick one? Yeah, I mean, we can do whatever we want. I think it's we just any celebrity. One, two, three. Yeah, yeah. Could do mean, three. any celebrity, anything that's going to be notable, yeah. you know, on E News or and not from old age. So no, you they can like, die from whatever. Is, they like if I pick Madonna for all her injections she got lately. Well, if you think one. Madonna's going to die first before any of our our picks, then I got to do. I can't pick right now. Okay, I got to do research it. on this. Yeah. Okay, do you we'll want come to... back on our next podcast? Next podcast. All right. Yeah. Sun- Sunday. Sunday. Okay. Sun- Sunday. 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 Oh, Sunday. 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 Anyways, I don't know how we got on Deadpool. Oh, because of uh, the sports podcast. Okay. Right. So what's going to happen, Super Bowl? What's your prediction? I think Philadelphia is going to win. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Did you see that? Did you see the post from um, George Kittle? Oh no, no, no. I'm sorry. It was uh, McCaffrey. He said, "I hope both teams lose." 
It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> How fucking rad is that? Oh my god. Well, who do you guys Who's, want to you know, you know, Brett Favre is suing him. And who else? For what? Uh, for defamation. What do you say? I don't know. Some. I mean, Brett Favre has been like he he he's investigated or he wasn't arrested, right? No, I'm just, I, I think it's ongoing still. It's some sort of investigation. For some sort of <clears throat> for like money, him stealing not, money from not like a unemployment, but like whatever. something just that bad, like <clears throat> like what really really poor people collect. It was something he was funds that, that were supposed to go somewhere that he like welfare diverted yeah, somewhere it was like else. Welfare. Oh, wait, wait, wait. It was something like crazy. Like there that. was no way he was it's collecting welfare. Weird. No, he wasn't. He's not collecting. It was funds that were supposed to go somewhere, but then were able. He was able to use for something like his kids' volleyball team or something. <laughs> I don't. Ooh, exactly I heard know. about something like that. Um, this is Brett Favre. Yeah. No. Yeah. But it was like over a million dollars. It was. It was quite like a, a substantial chunk of change. But I mean, well, Pat McAfee that? runs. His, I mean, it, it is well. It's welfare. welfare. It's welfare. No way. It's <laughs> welfare fraud. Yeah, but that could be like wire fraud, where it's it just yeah, like, no. Who knows what that encompasses? It's Pat McAfee and Shannon Sharp. Yeah. Really. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What, what do they have to do with that? Well, I think because they they probably talked about him on their. Well, I mean, McAfee has his podcast. Yeah. No. Sharp is on TV. Yeah. So they probably oh. said something yeah. negative about him. Yeah. And Favre's got to come up with some money, so. He's going to sell. <laughs> He's looking for money, yeah. Wow. For a guy who played in the NFL so long, what the hell did he do with all his money? It, I, it was something with nonprofits and welfare. So it didn't yeah. necessarily. I'm sure he got chunked to being the one getting sued, but. Yeah, it was seventy-seven million dollars. So he oh, probably shit. didn't take seventy-seven million. From you guys welfare. remember? You guys remember the movie um, uh, something about Mary? So, oh, it's so good. Oh, yeah. Brett Favre. <laughs> Favre. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, how fucking good is that shit? <laughs> oh, Have you God. seen my baseball? Have you seen? No, my I'm open <laughs> feeling it. It's so good. Uh, East Coast, East Coast boy. You know, I don't, I don't have a dog in the fight. I don't care. Well, I don't. I don't like ball, any team. Yeah, I really don't like any team either. In the Super Bowl? Yeah, in the Super Bowl. Like KC. Yeah. I mean, I don't know. I don't even have any friends that are KC fans. So I just want a good game. I don't want to blow out. Just a good game. Hey, you know what we should do? Saucy's in the corner. Year. Like, yay, sports! <laughs> He's watching <laughs> soccer and surf league over in the corner. Yeah, I was pretty bummed when uh, Kelly Slater got knocked out this weekend. Mm. Who? Kelly Slater. Some girl. Oh. Who's she? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I think uh, uh, I want to see, or I'll go for whatever the majority's going for. I'm going against them. That's, I mean, I, think I, I, I don't care who wins this one. We need. I don't really either. Rolf, I don't know how much you guys like to lay some dollars on some oh. bets. Yeah. John can ask Amber if it's okay. Uh, <laughs> but we should go like an hour or two before the game Matt to your house and print out like a master prop list which is oh. all the silly bets so we can all put in a bunch of just fun ones right yeah, yeah. Just like two, yeah two bucks yeah. where two we bucks all just kind of we're all showing it. up an hour before to Matt's house probably like two <laughs> startle Kelsey <laughs> no I Kelsey's I actually just told day. Ronnie to show because he asked me today and uh, I think I told him like one thirty. <laughs> perfect what time's the game 3.30 well what time are we what time are we supposed to go over there Fuck it. One thirty, two o'clock, whatever. Like, because we got to do squares. We got to get things yeah. set up. I'm thinking 1230. Well, fucking show up whenever you want. I <laughs> fuck. Sorry. I told myself that I was going to stop pressing. <laughs> Sorry. So another, another just some reason I thought about Kansas City. Like, whoever goes to Kansas City. Huh. We should do a podcast when right. NFL season starts. We should go to an away game. Yes. Just like some, like Kansas City or Sit something front, like that. And, where and just go watch. Team but I, I, oh, yeah, think, well, I think their barbecue, like their um, tailgates Pretty are, like one, are some epic. of the best because of the barbecue that's in there. There's guys that show up like a day or two in advance and just start smoking meats in the barbecue. But barbecue. maybe we should go somewhere where we can go to a college game the day before on Saturday and then well, go to an NFL game the next Justin. day. Is there music? Like, up like, <laughs> yeah. what, are you, what are you doing over there, man? It'd be so fun. The Double mastermind dip. over there. I was trying to get that. All right. Have you seen my baseball? <laughs> Popping in some music. <laughs> Getting uh, some juicy game, music though. going on. For some reason, it's not loud enough. I don't know. We're still trying to work out the kinks of the no. sack podcast. Does that actually go into the um, audio on the on the podcast? It is, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it totally Click is. the wrong yeah. button. 
clicking the wrong. Matt's over there doing some crazy shit. Doing some crazy shit. <laughs> I hope that uh, Kansas City wins because I hope that the Philadelphia Eagles eat shit and die. So <laughs> they do have the worst fans. Though. Even no. Shout out to Brian Grant, but like Philadelphia has, has some bad. Fans. Like right. Boston, Boston has some Mike bad Trout. Fans too. They got Mike Trout. They got uh, Bradley Cooper. Bradley Cooper. Beautiful eyes. Beautiful eyes. The guys from Always Sunny in Philadelphia. Oh yeah. Oh, those guys oh, are amazing. Those guys. No, we're for Phil Ryan. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, those guys can fuck off. Sorry, I just said the F word again. You still never seen that show, huh? Which one? Always Sunny in Philadelphia. I've seen a few episodes. It's funny. Dude, it's amazing. <laughs> that is good. That is good. I mean, it's not as good as Seinfeld. He's not impressed. It's pretty good. He's not impressed. Well, it's too... It's, it's I know. It's very different. Totally it's, different. Totally hey, understand. Hey, something that I just thought about. Is this the first Super Bowl with uh, two black quarterbacks? You know what, Sam? I think he's right. Or uh, is uh, Patrick Mahomes? Is he? He's like half, no, he's half half black. He's half black. And then you have um, Jalen Hurts. Jalen, Jalen Hurts, and he's black, right? Is this the first time ever? Oh yeah, I think I that's think a big is. thing about yeah. it. That's a big thing. I haven't seen any talking heads. I don't really watch ESPN outside of whatever. But anyways, no. Yeah, maybe. I can't think is of another it? time. I think it is pretty interesting. I don't know. I'll see what happens. Um, Valentine's Day. What do you guys think about Valentine's Day? I think it's a fucking hoax. I think it's one of the best holidays that we can... No, that's, that's fucking garbage. I think it's a Hallmark holiday. I think that... Uh... <laughs> totally retail. <laughs> but I got fucking roped in, though. Like, it's... What are you doing? Are you doing that? Yeah, what are you guys well, doing? Uh, no. So, my wife's a vegan. So, she orders her own chocolates. Like... Did she not have regular chocolates? No that way. Co- no. Well, she no orders cho- oh, her own no from like Switzerland yeah. or something? Right. I don't know where they come from. They're expensive though. <laughs> yeah. Well, here's here's a little story. So, have, have, you, have you seen my baseball? <laughs> <laughs> there it is. There it is. So, two years ago, Amber's like, all I want is strawberry chocolates. And I go to the store. I'm like, okay, cool. Strawberries and chocolate? It's like, chocolate strawberries. Oh, hey, so then I'm going to say, cho- strawberries dip- dipped in chocolate. Yeah, there we go. And so I go to the store. I'm like, they're fucking $35. 30, it was like 37 something. And I'm like, this so is... We're getting $37. Where it comes with 100 <laughs> strawberries. Like, no. This is ridiculous. No, no. It came with like it could be a great deal five in five strawberries oh, dipped in chocolate. And I was like sitting there like, this is freaking ridiculous. I'm like... It's not even about the money anymore. It's about the principle of you just completely just sticking it up my ass for these five strawberries. So I was like, no, screw this. She'll do that if you give her five strawberries. (laughs) Valentine's night, you get more freaky. Well, you know, it's Valentine's, so you get to dip, dip, dive. (laughs) Dip, 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 dive. dive. (laughs) Okay. Uh, So I'm like, okay, it's the principle of the thing. So I didn't get the strawberries. So I decided to make my own. Didn't come out as planned. Like, didn't look as good as theirs. So I present it to to my wife. You know what he did is he went to, like, Olive Garden <laughs> and grabbed all their free chocolates <laughs> <laughs> and melted them down. No, no not even that. <laughs> <laughs> like, the uh, the magic shell or the, uh, yeah. what is it called? Magic, magic shell. Mag- melt yeah. out. Magic shell. Yeah. So I got some strawberries, mm-hmm. did the magic shell. It looked like a hot mess. But you know what? I was like, oh, hey, magic shell. Yeah, magic shell. Oh, like the shell. stuff that you squirt yeah. out and then and it hardens just, on the. Yeah. So it's not like I thought you said magic show at first. Yeah. No, magic shell. Okay, magic shell. And um, she didn't quite like it as as much as I thought she would. I wonder why. Yeah. You tried but, though. I tried. Yeah. I took the time to do it instead of just paying the thirty eight. A full fifteen minutes worth of work. No, it it took a while because I had to get them, buy the strawberries. Clean them up, get them all fresh, get them all juicy, get them prepared for that that Ooh. chocolateness, and then I plop the chocolate on there, and and then it just turned out to be a hot mess. Mm. This just seems so stupid. Yeah, yeah. It's just like some day that that they made up so that you have to do something and buy you know cards and and what up lace. I, I don't know. I think it's so stupid. Um, maybe maybe somebody thinks it's a good idea because you know it's one night or one day that you try to like with your spouse to try to make things hot no. and heavy, but like that ain't well, happening. In my, I still in I my, think there are like, some women in, in the there woods that, so, that like, find that day like uh, appealing. I don't know if they're married or not, but yeah, there's some women out there that are like want to be treated nice on Valentine's Day. 
What do you do like that? Like the married, yeah. no, 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 no. Yeah, what, what does Sam the married do guys are like, this is, this is a fucking retarded day because we <laughs> go through life every day together. So right. we don't need a day to right. make each other feel special, right? Yeah. You, uh, but in the meantime, what are you doing? Yeah, what are you doing? Sam? Yeah, what are you, what are you doing? <laughs> we're not doing anything. Oh, that, I mean, we're not doing anything. Then. Not is this like, Aaron before or after? <laughs> <laughs> Tell the truth, Sam. Because <laughs> when this drops, I just kind of want to be outside his residence. <laughs> yeah. Swear. Swear. We're not that's, doing that's anything. That's how we roll. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Oh, man. All right. Oh, I, I, back, I, I, back in the day, Jesus back in the day, Christ. like when you were in high school with your high school girlfriend. Yeah. You used to buy fucking oh, teddy bears, college. chocolates, flowers, college. everything, right? Yeah. yeah. But like... Now, since we've, you know, 20 years later, we've come of age. Yeah. It's, you know, we, we have our senses a little bit, you know? So, yeah. It doesn't really fucking mean as much. All right. So, let's segue this into womanscaping. Ooh. All yeah. right. So, we talked a lot about something. our dicks and our balls. And our buttholes. In the last couple of. No, we did not. <laughs> I think someone did. <laughs> no, we didn't. No, we did. No, Steve, we didn't. I think it was you. No, Pretty we sure talked it was about you. our dicks and our balls a lot. But actually, so we have <laughs> some comments. Yeah, the ladies that from our to swimmers. Us, yeah, one of our swimmers was listening. Yeah. yeah, and wants to know the lady swimmers wants to know what we think about womanscaping. I know and what Steve how they thinks. like it. Mm-hmm. What do you What do you think, Steve? Well, you just what's said you know what I think, so go yeah. ahead and speak well, on no, what I just think. Just go for it. No, 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 no. What do I think? What do you think? You just said you know what I think. I want to hear it. Well, first of all, I haven't seen a vagina until I got married, so that's, <laughs> that's, that's my consensus on it. Well, now we know that Sam's a fucking liar. <laughs> is that, like, is that a culture gay. thing? He was super gay. <laughs> super gay. <laughs> that was super weird. Not a little gay. Super gay. <laughs> All right. I don't know. Sorry. I would say that I personally like them bald or like a landing strip oh. only. What's a landing strip? It's it's basically just you're coming in. <laughs> oh, it's, and it's, it's a, a landing. Kind of look like a Hitler stash almost. Like. <laughs> <laughs> not quite. Not quite. Not quite. Let's <laughs> good. Let's keep Hitler out of this. But okay. the, the landing strip's tight though. Yeah. We don't. We don't. We don't want trees. We don't want trees. We don't want trees. We don't want monkeys going. <laughs> To and fro okay. between okay. the trees here. All right. You know, we want nice and tight yeah. landing strip. Okay. Close to the body. I like that. All right. So, Clean. Would, they, so would they use a razor or, or would they use ball. clippers? What? Well, you can use like a... How do they do that when it's use not a fucking tight? razor. Well, yeah, you but how do they get it when it's just a little bit higher well, it's, it's the just, landing strip? It's just like a little trimmer, like a like a beard trimmer. Yeah, do they have that? Yeah. I've never, I've yeah. never asked. Shit, yeah, that's a good question. It's like yeah. a beard trimmer for the vagina. Yeah. yeah. I've never known a girl oh, who... Well, I've known ones that have so that, what but I never asked it? how they do it. Yeah. Is it a womanscape? It's a womanscape. Dude, I didn't even okay. think about that. Yeah, you like can't just... Buzzer. There's no way that they use clippers. Yeah, scissors? it's too much. Uh, what if they use scissors? Too much flappiness going on down there. <laughs> they get like real down low and scissors. Well, no. I guess it depends on the girl. Do you think it's part of like their hairdo? Like, because it takes them hours to get their hair done. Yeah. No. Do they well, do it down there? There's all those type places nowadays. No. Uh, you could do the Brazilian wax jobs. Mm-hmm. That that just seems super. Do oh, you no. think and that what you do now is you just zap it? Yeah, yeah, the laser. Fucking laser, man. Do you yeah. think that a majority of women are bald eagles? Mm. Nowadays, I think. I would so. say so. Okay. I like to think it's so. probably age based also. So do you think? That it's either when bald I look at a woman, I just assumed it's bald or landing strip or everything, just a full afro. God, if right. I saw an afro pop out, <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> you whip out your machete and just start backing away. Dude, he was like Freddy Cougar. <laughs> How good, yeah. like at the pool, like you go to the pool and just just one of just the bush popping all outside. See, I've of the seen that. Have you I seen just, that before? Like I've at the beach. That. I've never seen oh, yeah. it. You just happened to look up and like... Boom. <laughs> I remember seeing that as a kid and being like so turned on. <laughs> I, dude, it was like it was like an area... You could, you're like 10 years old, 12 years old, and you see this and you're like, oh my God. Wait, where did you, you see a vagina when you were 10 years old? Yeah. No, no, and I'm the saying like... Out. Like it's popping out. Hair sticking out. Yeah. Just like tarantula arms sticking yeah. out of the, the bikini. It's like trying yeah. to grab you. Come on, man. <laughs> It's like where the bathing suit's yeah. just on top of hair. It doesn't even get to their skin. It's just like, like it, but then when you see so it much. and you can see it, oh, man. 
When I, I mean, when I was like that age, I was yeah. like, little Stevie back, had a boner. <laughs> Dude, I couldn't tell you one time that I noticed a woman's bush hanging out of her fu- out of her uh, swimsuit. I, I've, I've noticed. Were you ever a little boy at the beach huh? all the time? Were you ever a little boy? I th- yeah, well, if, uh, yeah, apparently. Jesus, well, dude, did you just go from like seven to thirty nine? I, I guess he wasn't a crotch stare. I just don't remember <laughs> thinking that. You make me feel bad right now. <laughs> Those Stevie's <laughs> like in, that's like care in a tent. No, I'm gonna need to talk to a therapist now. You guys about this. <laughs> You grew up on the East Coast, so it might be a little different. It's cold. I don't Jersey Shore, man. Well, it's mm, cold out there. So you, you would think that there's more burly hair out there. Yeah. I'm trying to keep warm. Here You're in trying Southern, to keep Cal- your vagina Southern California. Warm? I mean, it's like nice and hot. Yeah. You keep everything warm, just more hair. Well, I think California's on the edge anyways, probably in what do you mean? That type of just progressive and shaving. Yeah. Like California. There's not a lot. Because everybody's in bikinis all the time. So you think yeah. I'm going to shave for my bikini versus right. probably on the East Coast. You're not in a bikini that often, so you don't no, think about it. That's very true. I yeah, but so. I mean, wouldn't you... It's one thing... <laughs> you can't look you in the eyes when you're it's, talking it's about it. It's one thing to be like turned on about it's it. One, <laughs> it's one thing to like do a, to be in a bikini, but it's also just one thing just to be hygienic. Mm-hmm. Like to like shave your bush. Yeah, but it was... Right? Well, yeah, but your face is clean right now, right? What? Your face is clean. You he got a bushy face. face. You cleaned your face. <sighs> oh, he's got you. you. To go he's there. got you there. <laughs> he's got you there. You got I mean, I don't know. Let me smell your face real quick. Maybe it's not. <laughs> I, I just, I just took a shot. Yeah. But when did that trend turn, though? Because in the seventies, that was yeah. That was, was like it's a whole new age. I was a kid thing. in the nineties, and I saw that. No, yeah, no, <laughs> yeah, it, no, absolutely, yeah. It's definitely an old school thing with the bush. But I mean, you know, things are cyclical. They, they come around, yeah. but. No, you got like come 13 year old girls wearing G strings nowadays, which is terrifying. Uh, and you like, notice them at the pool. I'm just glad that I don't have any girls. Fuck you. <laughs> I told myself I was going to use that word, but I'll. <laughs> we will fight you here. <laughs> we will fuck you. <laughs> we will, yeah. I don't have to deal with that. So I don't know if we yeah, answered the question. Do or they only do with dudes with boys? <laughs> That's right. Well, this is my answer. I think change it up. I think you like don't be the same all the time, you know, like bald eagle. But once you laser strip, it, there's no going back. Put like a fucking American flag in there. I don't yeah. know. But but do you like a bushy American flag? Or do you like a tight, clean one? Tight, like yeah. uh, you yeah. know, like a one. It's yeah. gonna be harder yeah. to do. Yeah. Fifty stars, the That's thirteen right. lines. Well, no. That's does crazy. It, does it wrap around the back? Japan would be easier. <laughs> Japan flag would be easier. <laughs> Does it wrap around the back? Yeah, who knows? Get a design in there. Do like a dragon thing coming out. Like <laughs> <laughs> This guy just took the Chinese New Year to a whole new level. We need to take our single friend to go get lasered. Oh, yes. Ooh. We could do <laughs> I got a connection. Okay. Wait, you do? Are we going to laser his balls? You have a connection to, to laser it? To la- the hair removal? <laughs> We're going to I already have Is a Is this a spin-off of like a, the, that scene from the 40 year old virgin? I, I got uh, a connection. What's your Wait, connection? Yeah, what's your connection? I mean, I don't, I'm not dropping names on here, but yeah. we can talk about oh, it. Oh, it's your... Can I get my balls laser? Your sister. No. Come on. No. Why not? You're, I don't even know if you're allowed up there. Chaz gives his Because I'll tell you This laser John's butthole. Man, get my juicy bottles. <laughs> See? Laser. <laughs> uh, I think that's a perfect segue into yeah. uh, Saucy's <clears throat> fucking bath bombs. Oh, dude. So this guy sends us a text message of this package. Here's a picture. Oh, yeah. Here's a picture. Dude. I'll throw it up there. I'll throw it up there. Are you going to throw it up there? Yeah, I'm going to throw it up there. Well, you know what? I, I did take a... I was going to send this out, but I totally forgot. Oh my God. So I took a juicy bath last night, and um, I thought that was a joke, man. Dude. I thought that was. I thought you were like taking a picture, like oh, no, Amber's was, bath. Bombs. I took Those a your uh, bath snow bombs. and plum blossom clarity, <laughs> and I combined that with the uh, misty moon. Comfort. Used two bombs. Oh yeah, I bombed it big time. Double bombing. Double bomb. Wait, can you do two different like scents at the same yep. time? Yeah, dude, just mix that shit. <laughs> or gas. Get like a juicy. What's the light level in the room? Deal? What's the what? light? Well, you know he's into his LED, uh-huh. so there's... Yeah. Oh, dude, you know, it's so funny. I don't have any batteries right now, but I used to plop these, like, you know those waterproof lights that just, like, LED? You, you put them in the colors? bathtub? Just throw those into the bathtub. <laughs> oh, God, this is great. Oh, man. 
<laughs> amazing. First off, I've seen him in the shower. It's pretty awkward. <laughs> we can put yeah. the picture right here. <laughs> no, we're not going to put the picture right here. We'll no, put we won't. a picture yeah. of Saucy in the bathroom. We, we have to. Like that. No. That's when he was doing his Just for Men, right? Yeah, he was getting the... Oh, Something was wrong, though, because he was dirty, because he was washing an area really fast. Oh, yeah. But <laughs> I, hopefully you got it clean. And you saw a pole in there. You're like, what the hell? Yeah. Does he have a pole in there? That's just a big, big old hog. Yeah, why was your dick so hard? <laughs> <laughs> so Saucy We're loves to take... Up, dude. So <laughs> I love to take baths. Steve, Stephen, took his first bath. What when, was my what, first bath? It was your first bath since becoming a grown man. That, that's not true. Are you sure? But... The bath bomb, I did use one. Yeah. Did you it, do the candles? It was pretty... No, I didn't use candles. You didn't do candles? No. Like a low lighting? No. Saucy. Oh, I mean, I do. I did do like low lighting. Like I turned yeah. on... Actually, I'm I'll low tell low you right now. Though. I've done bath bombs before. Actually, I've done shower bombs too. And how, how, Wait, what's, what's a shower bomb? A shower you bomb? put them in the shower. How is well, that? I mean, I figured it's that much. What does it do? <laughs> Dude, all it does is <laughs> fucking like irritate. All it like does is irritate your sinuses. Yeah. Like, you, you, I don't even know how you do bath bombs. The bath bombs, they like, it, it just hits your sinuses. He's not doing the right ones. No. Uh, no. Where did you, you get your bombs, Sweetie, man? he's not doing the right ones. He, he's not doing the blossom cherry. <laughs> Cotton fields. <laughs> Cotton fields forever. Is the pepper spray bath bombs? <laughs> yeah. Pepper spray. Yeah. must be doing the pepper spray bath bombs. <laughs> <laughs> Those assholes. Yeah, they got you good. They got me good. Dude. They're pepper like, this is beautiful That would lavender. be pretty funny. Shower bomb. Yeah. Dude. A pepper. Oh, my God. A million dollar deal. What? Write right this down. Write that down. Yeah, write this. that down, please. This? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What are we writing down? Pepper spray bath bomb. Pepper, pepper spray, spray bath bomb. Pepper spray bath bomb. You can make your own bath bombs, too. Yeah. TM. I'm going to start doing it. I'm going to start doing like a neighborhood bath bomb. You should. We should do a pepper spray one somehow. And like yeah. give it. You could call it Saucy's Bath Bombs. Oh, dude. Juicy sauciness. In juice, your, juice bombs. In your... <laughs> this is a fucking nightmare. This is an absolute nightmare. All right, so how did you get into bath bombs first? I was like... Well, I've been into baths for a long time. Well, and how long, he first, how long, he how first saw David Hasselhoff running on the beach. Wait, can we put a bath bomb in the jacuzzi tomorrow night when we go? Oh, dude. can we do that? Or well, is it will it ruin it? You will probably won't even see much of it though. With the bu- have no bubbles. Yeah, I don't know if that's that strong like, enough. It's gonna f up. I don't, I don't know think. I think there's too many up. chemicals in the jacuzzi. Dude, yeah. I don't know about you guys, but last Friday when we were at the jacuzzi, I got out and uh, when I got to home, I smelled like chlorine. Dude. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. There was so much chlorine in that. Oh, there's Jesus. 20 kids in there too, so it's probably a good thing. That's a Thank good thing. God. Yeah. They are just pissing it's all over each other. Piss. None of them go to the bathroom. Ugh, it was nasty. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, dude. After I took a shower, I got out of the shower. I still smell like chlorine. What happened? You peeing in there too? What aren't you gonna lie about? Yeah. You just said I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> what aren't you gonna lie about? <laughs> <laughs> it was weird, man. Saucy, you pissing in the he's, jacuzzi? He's, he's not pissing in the jacuzzi. He's such a liar. He's pissing in the jacuzzi. You done it all the time. <laughs> you can uh, rewind the podcast. If you're listening right now, rewind the podcast, but go back fifteen seconds and listen to what he said. I'm not gonna lie to you. What are you not gonna lie about? <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. Those kids are pissing. Like kid. I'm not gonna lie to you. Yeah. 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 <laughs> not all the time. I would say (laughs) only emergencies. What's the emergency? Your legs aren't working? (laughs) Or I just have to go. What's your level of emergency? Jesus, too relaxed. So (laughs) cold outside. (laughs) We're finding out the truth. The true saucy right now. Oh my gosh! So you're saying you're now every five minutes it's, we have to it's be just like, you. What's the last time you peed in the pool right now? You probably peed in it last day we're in there. No. How how can you relax? Like it's hard to relax and pee when there's somebody literally right next to you. Right. Oh man. Well, I'm sure if I just pee right in my wetsuit. Practice. Did you pee in your bathtub too? Oh, right. <laughs> yeah. Why not? It's just you. It's your urine. Yeah. But. That's like, disgusting. That's disgusting. So no, 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 he's referring to what you do in the hot tub. <laughs> <laughs> Not the hot tub. 
Dude, I, I would say 90% of the time I get up and go pee. 90% of the time? I go every time. 10%, 10, 10% <laughs> of the time I may let one squeak out. <laughs> squeak out. <laughs> what is going on down there? <laughs> Jesus. All right. 10% of the time you guys are swimming in my piss. <laughs> <laughs> Saucy's bath bombs, oh, and uh, I'm, I'm gonna lie, dude. You guys try it. Get some candles. Oh, we're not pee in a hot tub. Yeah, that's sounds like. What? I was like, I'm not trying <laughs> no. that. No, get some get some bath bombs going. Get your light. Uh, may have like a whiskey, a glass of wine, and then a nice podcast going. Whew. It is juiciness to the maximum. How long do you stay in there? Probably like 45 minutes to an hour. Oh, 45 Dude, doesn't the water turn from like 90 to 60? And Well, dude, well I, if you keep urinating, it yeah. keeps the temperature <laughs> up. <laughs> you keep it at 98.2. Oh, man. Oh, man. No, you get it hot, dude. You get like you get that smoking hot, like 100 and some degrees. Do you, do you have music on? How do you get it to 100? Not if you have like a oh, podcast. podcast. It comes yeah. out the, the pipe, faucet. 120. You, I mean, what temperature is your faucet at? Yeah, I mean, we have it set at 120 in the garage. Yeah, so there you go. You can get up to 120 if you want. I don't think it comes out. It doesn't feel like what? It, it comes out. It comes out very close to 120. Yeah, but it does. We don't lose a lot. Yeah, um, yeah. So just but it's it not going to stay at 120 very no. long. No, no. I mean, they're huge tubs, so. Yeah. I, I don't know. I feel like I get that thing as hot as I can, and it's you know, it's 30 degrees less in like 10 minutes. You're I don't sitting know about there. That. I don't know. That's just me. Anyway. <laughs> All right. I also get bored in there. Jesus. Yeah. Well, if you got a if you got a good podcast on, you're, you're good to go. You can listen to us. This, you're listening listen, to sack. He's listening to sack. Listen to the sack. Can we, uh, can we hear about sack. Steve's uh, Korean Thanksgiving? Oh yeah. Tell us about your Korean oh, Thanksgiving, oh, guys. So stressed. <laughs> that was uh, oh, interesting. So we're hosting. So preface, like tell the tour, tell our swimmers what. That's what I was doing. Uh, it was interesting. So. What are we in? February? We just had Thanksgiving yeah. last weekend. Yeah. So we're hosting two girls from Korea. Yeah. Sammy here is hosting three and then just picked up a fourth. That day. <laughs> that day. Oh, I didn't know that. I didn't, I didn't either. know that. <laughs> yeah. That's a lot. He's ha- he's outnumbered, dude. <laughs> that is nuts. You have five kids it's in your Oh, six kids it's in your like house. Pearl Harbor. How long? <laughs> They won. They won. Different, different country, though. <laughs> oh, shit. It's invasion in Sammy's house. I don't even want to talk about him. I'm so oh stressed out. It's, so what, it's a so lot. Wait, I don't. I honestly, I honestly I don't know, know how, how you, you do it. it because, like, my kids are like they're okay. Like, Alcohol. I'm sorry. The the oh. the kids we're hosting are pretty good kids, but it's still like you just turn around and they're just like there. Like always, they're just there. <laughs> like at least my kids, I put them to bed. Say that eight thirty, nine o'clock. They're like both of them are in bed by then. Like, and you think like our Korean kids are in bed, and all of a sudden, boom! Like I just walk around the corner, they're there. It's like always there. Can't walk around. The package of ramen. You're like, can you make this? <laughs> they're, well, our ma- ours make their own. That's what I'm saying. Like, Ooh, nice. that's nice. I'm spoiled. Yeah, you <laughs> you're making you ramen were. at ten thirty. Yeah, I don't have to do it. They do it. But I'm just like, dude, always there, always there. So anyway, when early on when they showed up, my wife was, she decided, let's, what do you guys want to do? And let's put together this whole, like write down everything you want to do. We can pick something out of it all the time. And we'll, so one of the things they want to do is Thanksgiving. Because they don't have Thanksgiving in Korea. And it's, it's not part of their country. Well, of course. Yeah. Well, yeah. It's only America. So we're ex- Tanya, my wife's explaining it. And now these kids want to do it and i was like okay we have like a turkey and like one or two sides and it would just be something simple dude this was bigger than the thanksgiving that we do <laughs> it was, we normally have it I'm, was I'm, I'm counting my head right now nine people at my house for thanksgiving that's us that's my and then my oh in-laws my father-in-law and then her sister and, and her family that's it Nine people. We had, do you, how many did we have? 19. I think we had 19 people at our house. That is nuts. That's nuts. Yeah, it, yeah, it was crazy. 
And the amount of food. And it's like, was hey, was I want to do this. this. And I'm like, this is ridiculous. Like, this is too much. I'm like, this is just, like, I don't want to do this in freaking February. It was not like, fake Thanksgiving. It was <laughs> full on. Real I think it was more food than we normally do for Thanksgiving. Like, there was extra dishes. Dude, what was the prep time? Like, like no. were you cooking all that? Was she cooking for three days straight? Oh, yeah. There was two days worth of cooking. Oh. Two days worth of cooking. That's nuts. For a oh fake holiday. <laughs> On a, on a random sun, Sunday on, in February. It, it was... And then I'm getting heat for not pulling my weight like it's a real Thanksgiving. Something I didn't want to do. And... <laughs> Sam, <laughs> so he saw the looks. <laughs> so we roll I in, dude. Like, I'm stress-free. Just like roll. Well, you just rolled in from the oh, pool. Oh, just rolled in with like yeah. he's relaxed. A like, couple of kids cozy. that I had, I'm like, boom, you, you in there, kids. See you, motherfuckers. <laughs> like, literally, enjoy the trampoline. I walk in. Steve's carving this turkey with this big ass steak knife. I'm like, <laughs> if the look on his face <laughs> was Bryce, I wish I could have taken a picture. It wasn't even a proper knife. He was just like, <laughs> you could, you could just see the stress on his face. You should post some. On the put some pictures up. I'm sure you it guys got some amazing. good things. Oh, yeah. And I just couldn't. You don't see the stress on my, my face. Ball. Well, actually, I don't even know if I'm in the pictures. <laughs> because I hadn't. I don't <laughs> think I'll, I've I'll... ever seen Steve that stressed before. Yeah. And then, then after, he must have taken taken one of those deep breaths like ten times. Like, oh, I need to calm myself down. Anytime I, I anytime I thought I was alone, like uh, like not alone, but like <laughs> away, like you can over, you're overlooking everything's going on, and you're just like, motherfucker. Right. And it you're just like, like and I look over, and then there's Sam like giggling in the corner, like he saw me, like, and he's just like, no, and I'm just fucking pissed. And he's just over there, just laughing. But I laugh out of compassion because I've been there before when you're just like stressed out from something your wife has done, dragged you into, and you can't do anything about it. Something like a do tractor about it. Sam would have been, been Sam there. would have been smoking a heater while he's carving the turkey. <laughs> Thought about it. <laughs> He's so good. Little Ash. Like, like, oh, how like... was the turkey? No, no, no. You got to ask. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Sam did it. Sam did, Sam did it. it. We're good. <laughs> just tell Tanya I'm disappointed that you didn't do it on a Thursday. We no. had. Two turkeys. <laughs> two turkeys. What? We had two turkeys. Where do you even yeah. buy a full turkey right now? And that's what I right? had. Right? I'm like, where do you, I'm like, can you even buy turkeys right now? Where, where do you, you get them from? Where do you get them? She showed up, she had a turkey. And she had, we had, we had there was turkey? one family that was delayed in responding. <laughs> so once they confirmed, then she's like, she started panicking. I'm like, we got to get another turkey. I'm like, she's like, we got to do the math. And I'm like, I don't really want to do the math. Like, I'm not trying to figure out how many pounds this turkey is, how many pounds the average person eats. I'm like, I don't know how many pounds a Korean kid's going to eat of turkey. They've never had it. Like, the two kids that are in our house, they've never had it. I'm like, how are they even going to eat it? Dude, I had about one and a half of turkeys left over. <laughs> I had bags of it. I gave away bags. How many bags do you take? <laughs> like I think I gave him two bags of turkey. Two, bags of two turkey. gallon Ziploc bags. Six legs in that thing. Well, you know what? The important fucking tons of white meat. Six the legs. There's only two Steve. fucking turkeys. The important this was thing GMO. is, Steve, how do the Koreans love it? Oh, they how do they oh I mean, they enjoy it. It was just a big party for them. They just, yeah. they enjoyed it. To be honest, they're still eating the they're still eating the food. Well, didn't they we want? Freaking, didn't they want like a Fourth of July too? They wanted to experience yeah, Thanksgiving and Fourth of July like American I just went outside and started popping off shots. <laughs> I, was like, I, can't. I was afraid if Tanya heard them saying we want Fourth of July. She's gonna be like, we gotta go to SeaWorld or something, and we gotta watch live fireworks. Oh, man. <laughs> Speaking I just, I was of like, SeaWorld, that, that was Fourth of July. I was welcome to America. <laughs> <laughs> we went to SeaWorld on Sunday, the same day that you had Korean Thanksgiving, right? Yeah. And somehow you guys agreed to come to our house and let our dogs out. <laughs> and that was the other thing, Tanya. I'm like, wait, so Tanya and Steve are cooking this huge... I mean, to, to be fair, it, Thanksgiving was, it was just dinner. her. I was getting in trouble because so I, I mean, wasn't doing anything. I, uh, yeah, well, 
Anyways, but so Tanya was cooking this huge Thanksgiving dinner, and then Steve's got to come over to my house and let the dogs out to take a piss. And what did I text you? A picture or a video of no, no, no. Before that, no. Te- you, Would you, you let me down? You, uh, I, I, when she said that we had to do that, I was yeah. like, oh, I'll go do. It. I'll, I'll got, do it. I got it. Yeah. What do I do when I go to his house? You have a drink? I go straight to the freaking kegerator. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm out. Empty. Empty. I turn the thing. It was like <laughs> foam coming out. I'm like, well, well it's not a bad thing because I'm, I'm. I gotta refilm tomorrow for for. Uh, that did me no good people. last Sunday. I know. Yeah. I know. I know. I know. Wait, but was that the time you went in there and you're like, remember the time you put your balls yes. in my car? Yes. yes. <laughs> so I, I I pulled my penis out and stuck it on Steve's Tesla, which Tesla. has cameras everywhere. All over the fucking. Can we post a picture of that? Or no. We don't need to do that. It'll get, it'll get, it'll get flagged. We'll get That'll flagged. be on our OnlyFans. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And you know what's funny is I went to OnlyFans today thinking, I'm like, should I sign this up for it? I'm like, <laughs> we'll get somebody to pay a dollar a month, right? Yeah. This, sign up for our OnlyFans. My dick. I'm signing up at OnlyFans. <laughs> Dude, we should put our feet Tesla's out there. Tesla's going to get us money? I don't think so. Oh, wait. So do you do you remember? I mean, we can, we can put that picture on there. And then do you remember where uh, it was a podcast, a couple podcasts ago, we're talking about Salcedo's ankles. Yeah. Oh, we can plop those things up there. I took a picture recently. Those juicers. I'll send it to you right now. Dude, oh yeah. Feetfinder.com. <laughs> yeah. Those. Are, he walked his dog past my house. I was like, those things were looking so plump. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, someone's gonna love those juicers. He ain't getting trained. <laughs> Oh God! Look at those things. <laughs> oh, so good. Is that God? That's a definition. All right, we'll of put a the kankle. picture up right That's now. That's a kink. Here, here it is. Yeah, we're gonna right, put we're that up. We're wrapping this thing up. Only fans. All right, we're gonna do another podcast um, after Super Bowl. So we're having a Super Bowl party at my house. Wait, like house right tonight. after. Right yeah. after. Yeah. Same day. Right after, right after the game. Same day. I think we're all gonna be drinking pretty much all day, and oh, yeah. then we're gonna set up and we're gonna do a podcast afterwards. So it should be a complete shit show. Uh, this is what episode four, so that will be episode five. Oh, no, this is episode five. So episode six. No, this no. is four. It's four. This is oh, shit. Four. I don't know. So that'll be episode five. Yeah. All right. So uh, next week, do we want to do? Do you want to plug anything right. as far as <laughs> what the? F- because uh, my brother-in-law is going to be t- are, we, are we still batting around Yeah, having him on or yeah absolutely we wanna, dude we got to have guests for sure Yeah, so we might have your brother-in-law on and uh, I don't know how we're going to fit six guys around this table but we will absolutely. we'll fit it we'll make it work um, we'll squeeze in so that'll be episode in. six though yeah. you're going to be that would be episode just six. Blown away by the his act his accent. You might we might need a translator fucking based on his Boston accent. Yeah, Boston accent. Or you might just be blown away. Absolutely. Yeah. No. Absolutely. <laughs> All right. If you're listening to the Sack Podcast, give us a like, give us a comment, give us a follow or whatever. I don't know what the fuck. But uh, we're here and we're here for you for the swimmers. We'll so. get better. <laughs> the swimmers. We'll get better. We'll get better. We are, just we are getting better. better. The first we, one, I think we are rough. rough. Second one, better. Better. Third one, one rough. <laughs> went Is back that, down again. <laughs> as, it's like a, we're like a heartbeat. <laughs> as, as we like close it out, ride. Ride. Like a roller coaster ride. <laughs> as we close it out, Matt, can you put up a picture of when you took your telescope out and ch- took took a look at that Chinese balloon? Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Show them what was actually on it. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. The uh, the Chinese weather balloon or spy balloon. It, it yep. flew over H. Uh, uh, where they we thought live. it was Chinese. And uh, yeah, <laughs> so I'm gonna th- I'll, fl- I'll fly that right now. Literally, for sure. no. Do you like, see what was on it though? They found some spy equipment on it. Oh bullshit! Hey, no, that, was broadcast. Broadcast. that was our broadcast yeah. equipment. Yeah. No, they found a sack on it. <laughs> we're trying to get to our, our millions of swimmers. Huh? To be honest, that's the dumbest thing sack, ever. Do yeah. you think that China flew a oh, goddamn? Right, it's time. It's time. It's time. No, it's no. It. If you it's think China time. flew a goddamn balloon hey, from cheers. China over cheers, America, everyone. you're an idiot. Good pod, gentlemen. Cheers, Not to cheers. mention. Good pod. Cheers. 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 All right. They have it's the technology of satellites. I, I just muted his mic. I muted his mic for a bit. State your address. <laughs> <laughs> There's a white Sam, how does light blue look white?